Why you have to be so loud? Air conditioner loud? Gardener's loud? Math is loud! What? We're over here! We're solving equations with decimals! Oh boy! Now I got no problem with decimals, alright? No problem with decimals. But some of y'all might be a little bit scared of decimals. So, what do we want to do? Let's clear those decimals. You clear the decimals by finding out the deepest decimal. What am I talking about, deepest decimal? Looks like that's the hundreds place. That's the tens place. That's the hundreds place. That's the tens place. That's the hundreds place. So the deepest decimal is in the hundreds place. So what? We're going to multiply both sides by a hundred. That's going to clear those decimals. So I'm going to multiply this side by 100. And I'm going to multiply this side by 100. Now, let's do it on over here. What? It goes, it goes, it goes. And that's 100 times 0 0.16 times 6. Sick. And then that's, 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 that's 100 times 0 0.04x. All right. Okay. And we'll deal with this side in a sec. So back on over here. When I take that 100 and I'm multiplying it by these guys, now if I'm multiplying 2 times 3 times 4, does that 4 multiply by that 3 and that 2? Some of you are like, yeah, no, uh, it only multiplies by one of them. It doesn't make that 8 and that 12 and then you multiply the 8 and the 12. No, it makes that 12 and then you multiply it by a 2 and that's what's going on right here. I'm taking that 100 and I'm multiplying it by that decimal. All right, and when I do 100 times 0.16, I get 1.6 times that 6. Bam! And then I'm going to add it to, same deal here, it's not the 100 times that and the 100 times that, no, it's just the 100 times that. So then, 100 times 0 0.04, um, 4 x, that should have been blue, you my boy blue, make it white. Mixing colors. All right, now I'm over here. What, could you distribute in? Yeah, uh-huh. But first, let me just take care of that 100. Because again, like this over there, we're multiplying it by this number. And just consider that just like some other thing. So I'm multiplying it by two things, but really it's only multiplying by that first thing. So 100 times 0 0.08, that's eight. Great, wait. That should have been in blue too. So then that's 18 plus X. Now, I want to distribute over here. It goes, it goes, it goes. Ooh, ooh. And eight times 18, ooh, ends in a four, carry a six, 144 plus eight X. All right, and then over here, ah, Let's deal with this. 16 times 6, that's a, 6 times 6 is 36, and then I carry a 3. It's okay, they're not heavy. So then that's 96, uh-huh. And then I'm just going to bring down that 4x plus a 4x. Now I got x's on both sides, one of them on one side. Which side? Don't care. <laughs> Some of you guys are left-siders. The variable has to be on the left. Left. But I'm a positive person, so I'm going to take the small one and put it over to the big one. I'm going to subtract off that 4x from both sides, and then oh, I hate when you do this. It's like doesn't even make any sense, but you do it, so whatever. I'm going to leave it alone. So that's 96. That's equal to 144, and then I combine my like terms. That's a plus 4x. Now what? I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to subtract off that 144, and I do that now. I subtract the 144 from both sides. What you do on the one side, you must also do on to the other. Okay, and then left over on this left side, I don't know what I'm going to do with this yellow marker. Just make some more noise! Oh. 48? I don't know, check me. If it's wrong, put it in the comments below. So, I go, and I'm over here. Ah, look at that. Why are you so negative? Uh, because the big one was negative. And then on that right side, I still have my 4x. And then, DVD doll. 
Ooh, by four, sure. And I see that my X turns out to be a minus 12. And then what? You're on the car, you're on the floor. We're sorry, the number you have dialed is not in service at this time.